Good morning, guys, and welcome to another Bible story on here. I hope you all had an awesome week with your families, or if you go outside, enjoy some sun. Um, and I'm just so glad that you guys are here again uh, for another story. So before we start our story, what are we going to do? Yes, we're going to say our Bible verse. So if you all remember um, the motions, go ahead and do it with me. Ready? One, two, three. These are written so that you may believe that Jesus is the Christ, the Son of God. John 20, dot, dot, 31. Awesome job. Okay, let's try that again. Ready? One, two, three. These are written so that you may believe that Jesus is the Christ, the Son of God. John 20, dot, dot, 31. Awesome job, guys. Okay, go ahead and sit down if you stood up and let's go ahead and get our Bible story started. All month long, we've been talking about God's son, Jesus. We talked a, a lot about when Jesus was born. Can you pretend to rock a baby like this? Go ahead, rock a baby. Good job, guys. We talked about how Jesus grew up to help sick people, love everyone, and do amazing things. The only things that he could do. Can you make a heart with your fingers like this? Make a heart like this? Let me see them. Wow, great job, guys. We talked about how Jesus died, but on the third day, what happened? They rolled the stone away and Jesus came back. Jesus is alive. Yes. They rolled the stone away. Go, go, go. Yes. Awesome job, guys. After Jesus came back, he went to see his friends so that they could see that he is alive. They told people Jesus is alive and wrote down that Jesus is alive. So everyone everywhere could believe that what? Yes, Jesus is alive, but not everyone believed that Jesus was alive. One of the people who didn't believe was a man named Paul. Paul grew up believing you had to follow a lot of rules if you loved God, and I mean a lot of rules. One day, Paul heard people say that Jesus taught a brand new rule. Not a lot of rules, just one, one rule. Jesus' one rule was, love each other the way that I have loved you. Because Jesus is God's son, people followed him and did what he said. This made Paul very angry. Paul wanted people to follow all the other rules. He did not want people following Jesus. Do you know what Paul did? He started being mean to people who followed Jesus. One day, when angry Paul was on his way to be mean to more people who follow Jesus, he saw a bright light and heard someone talk to him. Who do you think talk, was talking to Paul? Hmm. Go ahead, give me a name if you think you know who was talking to Paul. Yes, Jesus was. It was Jesus. Jesus asked Paul why he was doing mean things. Then Jesus told Paul to go to a house and wait. After Paul saw the bright light, he couldn't see anything, but he wanted to do what Jesus told him to do, so someone had to help him find the house. Some of Jesus' friends came to the house uh, to help Paul, and they helped Paul because Jesus had taught them the new rule. Who remembers the new rule? Yell it out if you know it. Yes, the new, new rule is love each other the way that Jesus loves you. After a few days, Paul could see again. Do you think Paul believed in Jesus now? Yes, he sure did. Angry Paul, who is mean to people, became happy Paul, who loved people and believed in Jesus. I love this story because it teaches us that everyone can believe in Jesus. And when we believe in Jesus, we love people the way that Jesus loves us. So tell me, who can you believe in? I can believe in Jesus. Who can you, let's say it louder. Who can you believe in? I can believe in Jesus. You sure can. Let's go ahead and close our eyes and bow our heads uh, for prayer. Dearly Father, Lord, thank you for this awesome story that you gave us today, God. 
And please help us remember to love everyone around us just the way that you taught us how to love, Lord. Thank you for sending your son to be our friend forever, God. Please be with each and every one of these families um, and just bless their time that they have together at home. Please keep everybody safe, God, and just thank you for everything that you do. And God's name we pray. Amen. Thank you guys so much for watching again, and hopefully I'll see some of you at our drive-in service today. Bye!